530 on your Tuesday morning. We thank you for staying with us this morning, folks. I'm Casey Kantz. And I'm Maggie Smolka. Officials in Bedford County are investigating after a body was discovered in the woods. That's right. Our Lindsay Kennett spoke with the man who first spotted the skeletal remains and has more on how he reacted to making that shocking discovery. Bedford native Doug Wyant hunts all the time in the woods behind his family's business, mile level farm market, and greenhouses. Yeah, we, this is our hunting spot. Saturday, he took his 14 year old son squirrel hunting when they stumbled across something strange a skull. I seen like a, a bear skull and I uh, got down and it wasn't all there, picked it up, wasn't real sure, had myself in kind of a doubt. Wyant couldn't shake the funny feeling he had about the skull. But that wasn't all they found. I did see a shoe, and it was well withered, and that really helped with the the thing, the thoughts at home. Something wasn't right. That's when he called police, who confirmed Wyant had in fact found human skeletal remains. Reality kicked in. Yeah, it was a it was a real skull. Yeah. Sunday, a forensic team collected the rest of the remains. Investigators say the body may have been there for three to ten years. Definitely found a lot more than what I could see on top of the ground. Wyant says he's not scared to go back to his favorite hunting spot. He's just curious to learn who he found in the woods. Investigators are currently doing DNA testing to learn more about the age, gender, and identity of the body found. But at this point, police can't say whether or not they believe the death is suspicious. Reporting in Snake Spring Township on Lindsay Kennett, WTAJ News.